I've always wanted to travel, go where I want, meet new people, and experience life to the full. One of the ways I experience that fulfillment is serving the people of Chiapas, Mexico. When I was asked this year to go for my 11th time, I quickly said yes. My experience this year in Chiapas was incredible. Here's a little bit of what happened. First, we needed to buy a guitar. I wish you were so close to my face. A shiny one. I don't know how to explain it to normal people. Um, it sounds like this. Ew. <laughs> and the next morning, we were off to the airport. As soon as we arrive in Chiapas, we are completely immersed in their culture. The people here are some of the most loving and welcoming I've ever met. Within the different people groups in these mountains, there are hundreds of different dialects. It's humbling to see how little they live with and how full their hearts are. After a short drive, we arrive at our home base, Chinelo. My grandparents have been working here and showing God's love for over 20 years and their hard work shows. With dozens of Americans getting the opportunity each year to serve the community, a lot gets done. Churches are built in a matter of days. After pouring the concrete, painting the walls, assembling the roof, setting up electricity and building benches, hundreds of people are able to come and hear the gospel in a new area. Medical teams reach out to the sick, providing medicine, dental work, and advice to stay healthy and clean. People from all around these communities come to receive healing and experience God's love. Every summer, full-blown vacation Bible schools are put on to impact the lives of kids, teaching them songs, giving them shoes, reciting Bible verses, and breaking pinatas. It's a week these kids will never forget. My grandparents have blessed countless families in this community. I'm grateful for the opportunity to serve alongside them and show the people of Chiapas the grace of God. Chiapas always impacts me more than I could ever impact anyone else. Let them do good, that they be rich in good works, ready to give, willing to share, storing up a good foundation for the time to come, that they may lay hold on eternal life. She just looks up. <laughs> Thank you.